Hey everybody! Alright, so today I'm going to show you how to clean lint off of whatever project you're working on with polymer clay. Um, there's a few ways to do it. You can take an X-Acto knife and, you know, find the little piece of lint you want to remove. And you can scrape at it until it's gone. ever so lightly and then you just have to smooth it back over to get rid of those little spots <clears throat> another way is you can use your fingernails and just kind of pick at it until that spot's gone and then smooth it over again that's a that's a pretty fast way to do it but then again, you have to be very careful when you're picking so you don't make too big of a little dip in it. Okay, um, my favorite way though, and I usually do this, well, if it's very linty, I'll do it like in the middle of the project before I change colors or something. But I use rubbing alcohol and Q-tip and I dip the q-tip in so that it just gets moist not like overly soaked and then I'll find the spot that I want to remove and I will rub in little circles and look it picks it right up and I just do that over the whole piece and I'll, I'll rotate my my q-tip as I go that way I'm not putting the pieces right back on it it happens Look, they went right back on it. And you just pick it up again. And then if your piece um, of Q-tip gets too dirty, flip it around, use the other end, or just grab another one. Um, this is also a great way to get rid of fingerprints because it kind of eats the clay a little bit as it's working. So it helps smooth it out. Let's see if I can get a nice fingerprint on there. If you can see it or not. This also helps uh, smooth your clay um, if you're adding pieces and <clears throat> you can use a paper towel if you want and, and rub it on there to help smooth out your clay. This just depends on how big of a piece you're working with. Let's see, you just, you just go in little circles and if it, like I said, this is getting pretty full of white. So I'll probably have to change it out soon. Um, I was going to make a white dragon, so I, <laughs> I'll be doing this a lot while I'm working with it. So I figured I would give you guys a quick tutorial because I'm probably going to edit out all the times I do this on my dragon. But yeah. So that's it. You just find the pieces and make little circles. And that is how you get rid of lint on your work. I hope this tip helped. Let me know if you guys want tips for anything else. Um, happy to make them. And thank you very much for watching.